I'm not stupid. Let's see if we can massacre this leg. So we got sent this in the mail a while ago. I was meant to open it ages ago. I forgot about it, to be honest with you. I think we've got one to give away as well. So stay tuned for that. We have a set of electric pruning shears. Now I've used these a couple of times and they're kind of cool. We won't be needing that. So this is what we get in the kit. Obviously the electric pruners, 16.8 volt. We get two, two amp hour batteries, some oil and various tools. A little bit of irony here. What branch are we gonna get? Now these aren't for everyone, um, but if you do a fair bit of pruning, maybe it's handy for you. I think they do 20 to 25 mil. It's just ridiculously easy and really satisfying. Uh, last time I posted one of these, people got really upset. Um, anytime you post something that sort of makes something easy, you get a lot of people in the comments going, you know, how lazy are you? Or, you know, suggesting you're not a man or whatever. But, you know, I don't know, they're kind of cool. Let's see how they cut. It's like I run the kitchen. So I'm not sure how much pruning you do, but that is in a very short time. Very nice cuts, very satisfying to do. Now it says 20 to 25 mil. Let's go and test that out. I'm gonna try and find something a little thicker. So we have this cane chair. Couldn't find any thick branches. All right, that's roughly 20 mil. So probably not much of a test, but let's see. So no trouble there. We'll try this thicker bit here. Okay. Let's see if we can massacre this leg. Okay, so I wouldn't want to put my fingers anywhere near it. Now it's a scary bit of gear. It has a safety on it. You turn it on and it won't work. Need to press the trigger twice. Then it's ready to go. Now these are only the smaller ones. I believe they have a bigger set. I'm not stupid. Uh, what can we cut? Probably not a uh, test I'd recommend. Got a stake here. I think it might struggle through this. Let's see if we can cut it though. There we go, with a bit of effort. It actually shows you how sharp those blades are. This is just me pushing it in. Oh, I don't even need to. Well, there you go. We don't even need to uh, use the action. It's quite, they're quite sharp. If I just push it in it. <laughs> try this trim line to see how uh, accurate it can get. What do you call it, dicing? Dicing? When you cut something finely, like. Oh, yeah, a fine dice. Let's see what sort of a fine dice we can get with this trimmer line. Now, I don't know if you can see that, but that's less than a millimeter. Again, you're never gonna be doing that, but. Uh, what can we do? All right, well, this chair's useless now, so let's see if we can fit it in the bin with some help from the Kebtech pruning shears. So a completely pointless test, but you know, that was really satisfying, not gonna lie. All done with one finger. 
the thing works. People will make fun of it, but again, if you do a lot of pruning, it'll come in handy. I'm not saying you should buy one. I'm not saying you need one. It's a kind of cool tool. If you do like it, go and check them out. If not, no dramas, but I just like trying new things. 